We start new at five today. It was as cold as Mississippi can get this past week and icy road conditions meant many people stayed at home and stayed warm. But turning your thermostat up and letting that heat stay on 24 seven can cost you. WTVA's Garner Montgomery is live in New Albany to explain why. I talked with the CEO of a local power company and he says power bills are going to be on the higher end this month because of the freezing cold weather we've had all this last week. Your house may have been warm this week, but the source of that warmth is a furnace that's going to require power and it probably took a lot of power to combat the cold this week with it getting into the single digits well below freezing. There are ways you can find assistance in paying the power bill if you find it to be too steep. Tom Bigby Electric Power Association CEO Scott Hendricks recommended Lyft Inc. in Tupelo. That's a great resource for North Mississippians that provide utility assistance services to those facing high bill payments. But the best method to keeping your power bill low during the cold Sadly, is already too late, according to him. If you cut your thermostat down a few degrees, you might have saved some money. Otherwise, we can all expect a higher bill this month because we were cold. This was an uh, unprecedented uh, cool spell here in Mississippi. So I'm sure everybody that turned their heat up uh, can expect a little bit higher bill than usual. One way Tom Bigby is making things easier for customers is by suspending late fees and cutoffs for bills due during the past week and being lenient with anyone who mails in their payments because of course the post office has also been closed. So if you don't like what you see when you get your power bill this month, think about next time when it gets cold and thinking about saving a little bit of power for next time. Live in New Albany, Gordon Montgomery, WTVA 9 News.